to be a great leader, you have to understand yourself, to be aligned to yourself, to know your purpose, your driver. How do you want to be remembered? Yeah. You know, as a leader. And and because if you are not aligned with yourself, you cannot, you know, align with the company and, and include people and make others, you know, aligned with, with the purpose of the company. So the first thing I think I know, I know that it's not what you think about today because you have too much to do everything is fast you know uh, this this covid the heat was crazy and but i think it's a catalyst also so i think it's a good thing in fact yeah. but i you know, you know being you know taking time to pose just you know inviting the leader to pose for a moment to answer this question how do you want to be remembered what kind of leader you want to be and and really it's walking everybody said that today but this is so true we don't need any more hero leader we need a human leader but yeah, yeah. how to be a human leader right because we don't know so this is what my second book is going to be about it's about right. diving in into those questions so who you are so what is important for you uh, what getting in your way so are you are locked somewhere? How do you unlock yourself? And what next step to take? You know, where do you want to go? What is your vision? And yeah. how can I lead? Can you lead with empathy? What that means exactly? You know, where is the balance? Like, you know, someone said that, I think, Gary. Uh, yes, it's a balance, uh, being vulnerable, being, but, and also, you know, of course, you have to lead. It's, it's really like, you know, the captain of, um, of a ship. You are, you are the captain of the ship and uh, you are your crew. And uh, it's not anymore about do that, 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 that. No, 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 no. People are not, you know, nobody's waiting for that. Yeah. I think, you know, when you, you get, you know, in your leadership position, it's really about something else, yeah. something more human, something, I think something wonderful because yeah. you, you can, you know, you can make a, a, a real difference when you're here. It's not about what you're doing. It's about how you care. And someone yeah. someone says something great. It's people don't care uh, how much you know until they know how much you care, right? <laughs> and this is all, you know, everything we are talking about. And this is about, you know, again, redefining leadership and uh, and align yourself, know yourself, increase your confidence, be human, connect with yeah. people, include people, and try to make others, you know, uh, you know, align with your you, with, with themselves. Do the same, you know. Yeah, yeah, it's, no, it's, it's so powerful, and it's funny because, you know, I do a lot of work in the brand space and sales and closing deals, and I often say that people buy from people and brands they trust. They trust people and brands they like, and they like people and brands they connect with. And I'm just thinking as I'm listening to you, the same applies to leaders. You know, we, we, we're, we're only really going to be inclined to follow a leader if we feel like we trust them, we have respect for them, and we feel that we can connect. And uh, I think it works to leaders as well. You know, what, what do you think? Uh, Terry, what do you think? Well, thanks for passing it over because I think that's uh, very appropriate. You know, uh, not only can you do what you just said, Simon, but um, are they approachable? Does the, does the employee feel comfortable either knocking on that door or walking up to Mr. C or Mrs. CEO and saying, you know, I, I have a question. Okay, what is it? Mm -hmm. Or, you know, I've been thinking about something that may uh, drive a new revenue stream. Can I tell you about it? Well, sure. Mm -hmm. You know, and not be afraid to do that, even if they are the, the person who's answering the phone part time from a temp service. They have an idea and they trust you and know your ethical behavior enough and authenticity to walk up and, and try to uh, discuss something that's on their mind. That's mm -hmm. powerful very powerful. You can't teach that. It's just there. We're born with love. We learn all the rest of it. Mm -hmm. You know, you know if we turn back to the love that we started out with. Look at a baby's eyes. They love everything. Mm -hmm. You know, we still have that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And when we return back out to that is the, is the precipice of our soul, mm -hmm. things change exponentially and quickly. 